If you want to know how to cure angular chylitis, you should know how the condition progresses. The first stage is characterized by redness and discomfort in the mouth's corners. You'll also experience bleeding, blisters, and scaly skin. The infection may even leave an unpleasant taste in your mouth. At stage 3, the condition becomes difficult to treat. The condition can occur when the corners of the mouth become too dry, and a layer of dried saliva forms on top of it. This dries up the tissue, and the cracks become the perfect home for fungi and bacteria. Among the most common culprits are Staphylococcus bacteria and Candida yeast. A doctor will usually diagnose this condition based on the symptoms, and may also ask about your lifestyle and health history. One simple remedy for angular chylitis is using lemon juice. Massage it over the infected area for about 2 minutes each day. Repeat the procedure every 4 or 5 hours to maintain the condition. Another home remedy for angular chylitis is applying a homemade mixture of tree tea oil and vitamin E. This mixture should be applied 4 or 5 times daily. Cucumber is another natural remedy, as it contains water. Home remedies for angular chylitis may include applying cold-pressed castor oil to the affected areas. This can help you recover faster by boosting your immune system. You can also apply probiotic yogurt to the affected areas, as this type of yogurt has live cultures that can reduce inflammation and keep your skin moist. If all else fails, you can apply coconut oil to the infected area and leave it on for at least half an hour. While you should seek a dermatologist for proper diagnosis, there are home remedies for angular chylitis. If home remedies do not work, visit a dermatologist right away. There are also ways to prevent angular chylitis from occurring in the first place. However, the most common remedy for angular chylitis is antibiotics. Your doctor may recommend a prescription medication. You should also try to avoid smoking and drinking alcohol. If you suspect that your chylitis is caused by a fungal infection, you can take a mouth swab. Some people use bleach solutions overnight to prevent infections from forming. The bleach solution may cause a discoloration on your dentures, so you should use chlorhexidine or sodium benzoate mouth rinse to prevent this from happening. You should also look for persistent lip irritation, painful cracking, and fissuring at the corners of the mouth. While the herpes simplex virus causes cold sores, there are other causes of angular chylitis that are easier to treat. Several causes include a yeast infection, staphylococcus bacteria, and improperly fitting dentures. Also, angular chylitis can occur from allergies, deficiencies, and licking chapped lips. These factors can make the symptoms worse. A simple home remedy for angular chylitis should clear up the infection in just a few days.